Hello there and welcome to the next episode of x Basic to Lose. Here in today's episode we have PSG and Ren. If you didn't see the last episode, we got absolutely screwed over by Monaco and then put in a pretty decent performance at Montpellier. Apparently we got a bigger attendance than Monaco, which begs to differ, but I swear Monaco got promoted a couple of years ago. But anyway, I'm going to play it pretty much at the same side as we did last time. Andrea Pillow is still lacking a bit of match fitness, so I'm going to make him available for the reserves. But we're still six days away from the PSG game. So, anyway, let's get into that game. A couple of changes for the PSG game then. Uh, what's his name again? Imbudo's got an injury, car strain for three to six weeks. It's a decent player, so we're going to miss him. So now Ray comes in, I'm also going to play. Jan Bodiger, but he was dropping a bit, so I said you're gonna need to improve your train level four if you want to have a stake for first team football. And then he just got a bit, it got a bit handbaggy to be honest. So I brought in Sonagre, brought in Femin Mubele as well, quite a pacey winger as well Max Great will go to the inside forward on that one and swap the lot to an advance forward see if we can get himself a goal here we are then PSG gets to lose they only beat here Green Camp 2-0 but it was Neymar who got one of the girls to be honest after that Monaco result in the last game I'd probably take a 2-0 trap the goal kick for PSG probably a goal from here and it's probably going the same way as the Monaco one, but it's actually us who have the ball. Kaka's on the ball now. Him and Pillar decide to announce their retirement. But it looks like Kaka's interested in coaching. So if we can keep him on a coaching role, I will do that. I've put him on a coaching course that the club have funded. But anyway, let's focus on this game. Cavani's from goal. Makes a save out of Lafont. Six minutes in and Paris have their first shot on target corner from that resulting shot Verratti to take it Thiago Silva's front post doesn't really get there the first time but picks it up and Lafont with a goal kick towards the right hand side because I was just going to bring it down without any pressure a right winger just brought in not really great for pressure and Diop supposed to be one of our best defenders has not really shown me why he is one of our best defenders Pastore's picked up on the right hand side. Not much of a winger, but it's still a decent cross. And Cavani, I mean, I might have to put like clues down more because we are just standing off them and they are leaking on Happy like it's not even there. Because I was the free kick 16 minutes in, this could get dirty. We have to be to the box, scored in the Champions League. And oh my god, I actually jinxed it as well. Scored an absolute worldie in the Champions League and he's done exactly that against us. Hadjur and Rabio, I mean it's probably worth the whole of my team to be honest. Goal kick for Abel Lafont towards this right hand side. The Lord's chasing it this time and just about win it. Is it Zagara to Kaka? Probably not the best of play now. 35 year old and a 19 year old in the same team but it looks like with this PSG side they're going to give everyone a run for their money even Monaco I mean that would be a hell of a game passing it around us like we're not even there and Mbappe knocks it down to Cavani to Pastore got options left and right chooses right Cavani to Neymar, I mean, it was just an amount of time before they scored again, and just a matter of time before Neymar, Neymar gets on the school sheet. We've actually got a chance now, throwing left hand side towards, oh great, they want it back towards Kaka, and literally just give it back to him, and then I thought that was a foul, come on Julian, get to it, he's just walked towards it. As he's seen, no one was challenging. Spread it over to this right hand side. Femin Mubele is going to not really do anything with it, to be honest. Put him in for this game. That's a bit of a swap for 
great help, but it seems it was probably the wrong decision as they've done even less than they did in that Monaco game. I mean, they've had very little of the ball, but Cavani, I mean, doesn't strike you cleanly. Thrown for Toulouse to Kaka. Kake. Kaka. I say that so many times, it actually sounds weird now. Mubanji on the left hand side to Bilne for Delore. Gets one back, is it? And if it's not offside. And it is offside. Free kick for Toulouse and Julien. Forward to Femin Mubele on this right hand side. Cursing to Sanagre to Amy on this right hand side. Not sure what he's going to do there. Finds me Bele to Sanagre. Kaka, Bill, Gradle, decent football, but Gradle just hits it wide. Kaka, the f corner to Diop to Juliem. We're looking at pretty dangerous, but not really taking PSG at the comfort zone. Another corner to Toulouse, though. Kaka to take it again. To Sanagre to the box. Shot was pretty poor, to be honest. He's already on the yellow card. And that just summed up his performance. Kaka to Gradle. Back to goal. I slotted into the right hand side and brought Jimmy back on. And we looked a lot better of a team in that second game when them two had time and space. But looks like this PSG side is just a little step too far. And it looks like it's. Oh, please don't get him sent off. Yep, he's getting sent off as well. Julian. Here we are then. Yay. Gonna have to bring off Kaka as well. Just put the ball back as well. The midfield is just way too good for mine. And our passing in this squad is actually going to actually quite annoy me now. Because we can't even do like two or three passes. That Lafont kick was just exactly what we're about. Delort. Just just move, pass it to someone, do something. Verratti, Neymar. Ugh, his passing was pretty bad as well, but 3 0 that we can kind of deal with it. I mean, I'm tempted to not even do a second game of the episode because this game is annoying me. They don't have easy time. I know it's PSG, but we've had this for all three games. We can't even just drink a pass together. It's not even, we can't do two or three. We struggle to even do one sometimes. Max Gray is on a 5.7 as well. Starting only point seven off now. There's 10 seconds left. Long ball. And how is that free kick? Why is it a free kick? Why have you fouled him? I mean, there is full time. I'm not even going to do the second game in the episode. I'll see you guys for the next episode soon. But... Yep, yep, that just went completely ex exactly how this episode's going. Anyway, Julian's banned for one match. Absolute. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, apologies, not doing the second game. I'll see you guys maybe somewhere around here, maybe the cup game. But anyway, thank you guys for watching, and hope your day goes a lot better than this episode.